Hey Skin Truth family, welcome back to my channel. So good to hang out with you today. Hope you're all doing amazing. So for today's video, I am sharing with you a brand new powder, a brand new setting powder that just launched and look out. It is amazing. If you have more mature skin, you are going to be obsessed. The formula is so amazing. It doesn't look like powder. It doesn't accentuate lines and wrinkles. It does not sink into pores. It does not get cakey. It makes your skin look flawless. Need I say more? You guys know I don't wear a lot of makeup, but the makeup I do wear, I am very specific. I really tend to look for more clean ingredients, better for your skin, you know, healthier for your skin ingredients and that is exactly what I'm sharing with you today. So before I dive in and share exactly what it is and do a little demo with you, don't forget to join my channel here. Hit the subscribe button down below. Join my channel. Join our Skin Truth family here. You will get your best skin of your life no matter what age you are. I promise we are one big happy skincare community here and I love it so much. So subscribe, hit the bell notification so you never miss a video. So much important info and tips coming at you every single week. Meet me here on Tuesdays and Fridays. That is when I am most of the time here on YouTube, but then also head on over to my Instagram. Follow me over there for daily skincare tips and skincare routines. You guys on my Instagram get to see products before they even launch. I have fun, quick tips on my Instagram all the time. So after you're done watching this video, head on over to my Instagram, follow me over there, and let's dive in to this video. This is a game-changing powder here for more mature skin. Like I said, it's good for everybody, but when you get older, it is way harder to find a good powder like this, but we got you covered. Okay, so what I'm talking about today, what just launched, and I actually got sent this before it even launched. I've been wearing it, I've been using it, and I've been dying to share it with you guys. It's the new Osmosis Loose Powders. These are amazing. So they come in three different shades. They come in translucent, medium, and deep. They have a little sponge like this. Actually, not a sponge. It's like a makeup poof, I want to call it. And then you just pop the lid open, and then your product is inside. So this powder is all good for your skin ingredients. The main ingredient is mica, which is a mineral. It's a mineral-based powder. It's not talc. It's not a bunch of crap chemicals and all of that stuff. Osmosis always uses more mineral-based ingredients. And and this is by far amazing. So you guys know that I love the Osmosis Press Base Powders. These powders I've been using for years. And if you've used it, then you know exactly why I love it so much. Osmosis makes their powders with like the most genius like formulation because they don't look like powder on your skin. I have tried so many powders out there that just make you end up looking older throughout the day. They get cakey, they sink into little lines and wrinkles, they can dry you out, they sit into the little like pores, and it's just like there's so many that are just like blah. Like as you get older, you're just no powder. But that's where Osmosis comes in with their formulations because their powders do not look dry. And I've talked about it before because they kind of take it to the other like the other way, the other direction, because instead of a powder that makes you look dry, somehow their formulations, even if you have like the driest of skin, their formulation of powders actually makes your skin look more glowy and more hydrated. Like it's amazing. You can take their powders, use them over dry flaky skin, and it doesn't accentuate the flakes. It actually hides them and minimizes them and your skin looks flawless. So I am very excited about these new powders and I'm gonna share exactly how I've been using them. You can see the colors, all of that. So I'm going to use them and just kind of play with them with you guys today. So how I've been using them personally is I've been taking the translucent under my eyes. It is an amazing under eye setting powder that I've been taking the medium shade and kind of setting my T-zone. It makes your skin look flawless, you guys. Oh my gosh, look out. And then I've just been playing with the deep shade and I've been using that as like a powder bronzer. It blends in with your skin so seamlessly. So I'm going to share with you just exactly what I've been doing. So the translucent is literally just a translucent powder. It is so finely milled and silky. Like the formulation is perfection. So I just take this actually on like a dry beauty sponge and I'm just going to take this up under my eyes. I do have concealer on that I just applied. So I'm just taking this and setting that concealer. But I was so excited because this powder Honestly, it just makes the under eyes look so flawless and it does not get cakey. It does not dry the skin under the eyes. Instead, it honestly just makes your under eyes look 
amazing. So I've been taking the translucent. I actually use the medium under my eyes a couple times too, but the translucent just kind of gives me a little bit of brightness under the eyes. And then here is the medium shade. It's a good medium tone. It's, it honestly matches my skin perfectly right now. And what I've been doing with that is I've actually been taking the little powder or puff thing and I just get a little bit onto the little poof here. And then I will take this and I just kind of set down my T-zone because I don't have foundation on. I just have my tinted SPF combination on today. So I just have been setting everything with this powder. Honestly, this is, this is gonna sound shocking because I love the press base so much. There's something with this new formulation of a loose powder, which I honestly, like I have always tended to go to more pressed bases because I always felt like loose powders can be messy. But this formula is so good that I'm loving it more so than the pressed base. It just leaves your skin so beyond flawless. Okay, so we set everything with the medium shade and I'm gonna just use the deep shade and just use that as like a little bit of a bronzer. That way you guys can see the, the tone of it and all of that too, because it actually does make a really nice bronzer. And I'm gonna use this big uh, powder brush. This is actually an old osmosis brush, which they discontinued, unfortunately, because this brush is really, really nice. But you can use any, you know, bronzer brush, powder brush. And my hair is like out of control today. It's so humid and just so gross here in California right now. But look at how beautiful. And when you use this as a bronzer, because it's such a, um, just seamless, like beautiful finish and it melts into your skin. It makes an amazing bronzer. It just blends into your skin so well. So I've been liking the deep a lot as just a quick and easy, like really, really pretty, pretty bronzer. So do you guys see how that looks as a bronzer on my skin? You can see the tone. It is really, really pretty. Just makes such a good like warmth to your skin. So I'm just gonna finish up with a quick blush. I'm gonna use the Pat McGrath. This is the Nude Venus blush. And I'm just going to take that over the bronzer and just blush up those cheeks a little bit and just kind of finish off this quick, no makeup, really makeup look today. I love this blush though, it's so pretty. It's just such a perfect, like everyday, just natural blush. I use it a lot. It's just a great everyday little blush. All right, so that is it. That is your quick first look at the new Osmosis Loose Powders. Like I said, I honestly could not wait to share these with you. I fell in love with them as soon as I started using them and I know you guys will too, because like I said, honestly, it can become a struggle to find a good setting powder, a good powder, you know, as we get older. And these actually give your skin like an even more flawless look. So I hope you enjoyed this first look at these. I will link them down below in the description box. Of course, you can find them on skintruth.com. I will link it down below. If you have any questions, let me know in the comments. But thank you guys so much for joining me today. Thanks for hanging out and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.